Here we are given that the tension in the cable AC is 8 kilo newtons. So we have the dimensions 40, 50, 60 and 40. And we are asked to find the tension in cable AB such that the net effect of the two, that is of AB and AC, is in the downward direction. For that first we have to calculate these angles. So this angle would be tan inverse of 50 upon 40. And this one would be tan inverse of 40 upon 60. So we get the angles are equal to 51.34 and 33.69 degrees. Now AB and AC can be resolved into the X and Y components. So let's keep the horizontal is X, vertical is Y. Since the net force is in the vertical direction, the horizontal components cancel each other. That is the Tension of AC, the X component of tension of AC is the X component of tension of AB since both are in the opposite direction. So if we draw the triangle separately, so this can be resolved. into AC in the X component since we are given X component is horizontal and AC in the Y component. Similarly for AB we have AB in the Y component uh, tension AB in, uh, in the Y along the Y direction and along the X direction. So since this is the angle theta, this is cos theta, sorry sin theta opposite side. X component is opposite to the angle. So we have TAB X component which is sin 51.34 degrees is equal to TAC which is already given that it is 8 kilo newtons. So we can substitute 8 sin of 33.69. So we have TAB works out to tension in cable AB works out to 5. Point 6829 kilonewtons. So the net resultant force in the vertical direction would be the two will get added, which is the resultant, which is the sum of the y components of the two. So AB is cos 51.34 plus 33.69. So substituting the values of AB and AC, we get the answer as the net force in the vertical direction is 10.2065. Hello, Newton.